Good morning, everybody. It is Wednesday, November 23rd. We're back out on the trap line doing a check, and as I roll up here, I have got another red fox in the trap. Um, kind of give you guys a look here as I pull up. As I was mentioning last time in one of my last videos, um, Landowners uh, are the bread and butter of my winter um, paychecks. And the reason I say that is, is these guys will allow you to trap as long as you listen to what they have to say. So if you guys are looking to get into, you know, or if you're already into trapping, you know, listen to what the landowners just say. If they ask you to uh, check your traps every day, check your traps every day because that's the one way that you're going to get in there with them, get in good with them. Um, Give me just a second here to shut my truck down and I'll uh, we'll get this box uh, videoed for you. Alright, as promised, I've got this beautiful, beautiful red. Looks like she's been out here probably all night. She's got some frost on her. Um, once again, the government bait, floodwood fox dope, this stuff is working. And as you can see, they're uh, definitely some beautiful, beautiful animals. All right, we're going to stop here. We're going to dispatch this uh, fine-looking creature. And we are going to move on to the trap line. We'll catch you guys here in a bit. So we're back. This is the remake of the set. As you can see, I've just got a little concrete tube that I've picked up from uh, our construction site. That's no longer any good. It's about two feet long. Um, all I've done is I'll take a look in here. Kind of, if you can sign to see it, there's some wool back in there and some a Q tip. And what that does, it brings them in, traps right there. Just brings them in, gets them caught up in it. Um, other than that, we're, uh, we're headed back out to, uh, see what we can catch if we got any coyotes in our traps now. 